Hey guys, what's up? Today we're heading back to St. Louis, Missouri and the Dred Scott decision. Now Dred Scott was born into slavery in Virginia and has ultimately purchased and moved out to St. Louis, Missouri. Now John Emerson, Dred Scott's owner, was in the military. He moved Dred Scott out to Illinois, which was a free state, and the free territory of Wisconsin. At this point in time, Dred Scott is a free man. Dred Scott is even able to get married and have two kids. Well, ultimately, the Scotts and the Emersons move back to St. Louis, where John Emerson dies. Now, Dred Scott and his wife, Harriet, their ownership gets transferred to John Emerson's widow. Now, Dred Scott tries to purchase his freedom, but fails, so he takes his case to the court system. And in 1846, he sues for his freedom in this courthouse. He loses. This court case goes to the Supreme Court. In 1857, Judge Roger B. Tawney issues the Supreme Court's decision that Dred Scott cannot sue for his freedom because he is a black man in America and African Americans were not considered citizens. Also, because Dred Scott was a slave, he was considered property and the Constitution protected slavery with the Fifth Amendment. Ultimately, Dred Scott gets freed. You want to find out more? Go find me at Sela Social Studies, subscribe to my Instagram, and subscribe to my YouTube channel.